Um, this one's called Volk. So, when I first met you, I thought God was playing tricks on me. I didn't want my retinas to deceive me anymore, so I prayed that night, and I told God, God, stop letting your angels loose, man. You're disturbing my sleep with so much light. The feeling was overwhelming, and I wanted to jump into your hug like a foster child, meeting his first real parent, his real parents for the first time. The first time you told me that you loved me, it was like you took a nap in my chest and started making snow angels in my heart. So I sent an incident report to the galaxy last night, and I told the galaxy that God must have sent an eviction notice to the stars. So the stars moved to your eyes to find a better home. You flourish like the intergalactic rose in your last name. You dig your hands into the orbit of my spirit, a soothing, mystical woman, whispering secrets to the moon, standing in outer space. Your mind is out of this world, and I want to create sandstorms with you on other planets. Hold tsunamis in the lifelines we cut on the sunset, so nature can take its course. Each night, we play on the, those 5,000 comets, playing hide-and-go-seek in the air. You're really enough to make my skin sing when we bump fists like 8th grade bros. Power your speech when we have tornado conversations. There's an earthquake in heaven every time you breathe. There are flames gleaming out of your pores. You are a walking light bulb, a moving idea, a rotating universe in my gut, my gut called inspiration. Your smile, your smile makes the sun want to light itself on fire. You blink like your eyelids are clapping to the sight of the Big Dipper in my retinas. Deep, deep craters pounded on the side of my face. I never knew a dimple had so much depth. You sound of a whistling cloud when you think, and believe me when I tell you that your rare moments of silence are as loud as the Big Bang, is as grand as evolution, as serious as laughter, as strong as your aura blasts off like the Apollo 9. My lady, my lady, sometimes I want to bleach my skin in red galaxies to prove to you that I blush every time that you're near. And when we are apart, I want to put a smoldering asteroid in my mouth, blow my face into a solar flare, make you come to my funeral just so you could hug me tighter than Orion's belt. It's amazing how you nailed your laughter onto a spaceship, you extraterrestrial the queen, basking in the glory of an Aquarius zodiac sign, and I'm here. And I'm still complaining to the universe. I'm still trying to figure out how those constellations can have picnics in your pupils. How you traced the solar system onto my skin with your fingertips last night. And last night, I convinced myself that I wanted to major in linguistics so that I could tell you that I love you in every language known to mankind. Because you are a queen, and I am a better man because of you. I know how to truly appreciate my mother because of you. I know how to love because of you. You give me inspiration to be happy all the time. I'm walking. I'm walking like a king because of you. So I have to ask you a question. Are you smiling yet or not? Thank you.